Oh, what a time to be alive. This, this, is, this is a weird thing. I've been, I've been thinking about this a lot. And I feel like this time in, in history is better than any other time to just fix whatever needs fixing. Because it's all falling apart, right? It's better to do it now than when things are going well. Like, I understand not wanting to rock the boat when the boat is at least afloat, you know? It's better to just fix things when the boat is completely upside down. <laughs> You know, like one of the things I feel like I don't, I'm not pretending to have all the answers. I'm just saying as, as a move, we should just do our best to figure out how to get rid of student debt. You know, like it, like the, the economy is already screwed up. Like just, just try is all I'm saying, because you should know that for international people, like when, when other people come here or when I have friends who are like from other nations and stuff and I talk to them about my student debt, I sound like I'm lying. <laughs> like other countries don't have this problem, so I sound crazy, right? In any other country in the world, if you fuck up your life $60,000 much, you did something, you know what I mean? <laughs> When I told my friend I was like $60,000 in student loan debt, he was like, shit, what happened? You got a gambling problem? What's wrong? You kidnap a mob boss's son? What'd you do? You know? No, I just wanted to read more books. You see how that sounds like a lie? 